we're live, gents. Uh, camera's looking good. Ready when you are. Yeah, fine. Um, I'm not sure if Declan can hear us or not. Uh, he should be able to hear us, he just won't be able to talk. Uh, I'm going to serve and mute both of you anyway. Um, but play well. Have a good game. Yeah, good man, thanks. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the ODL Live. I'm your host for the evening, Chris Livingston. Uh, and what a cracker we've got for you. Some excellent games coming up for the next three hours. Uh, we've got some big fish tournament, I believe, as fillers. Uh, but, I mean, let me just run you through a list of the games. Uh, we have uh, Innes and Deck coming up here. The Mountain Round 1, 1001 Best of 5 tournament we've been telling you about. Uh, I've got an ODL Open Round of 16 coming up later between Adam and Jamie. Uh, Sam and Stu in the Double Trouble Round of 16. That proves to be a cracker. And uh, another game later on between Mike and Michael. Uh, a Division 5 friendly Best of 7. Uh, I'm looking forward to this. This should be a very, very good contest between... Uh, all of these players just waiting for their games to, to kick off now and then we'll be right underway. I believe I said good evening. Well, let me say it again. Good evening, everyone, and welcome on in. Right. I'm getting word that we're almost ready to go. So without further ado, I'm just going to search for the game. And then we'll get the show on the road. Okay, bear with me, guys. Bear with. Trying to find the game on Darts Counter. I can't actually see it at the moment. I think they're both playing now, so I should be able to find them unless they're using the beta, but I don't think they are. We did have a chat. I can't seem to find the game. Hmm. Well, that is a bit of a pickle. Right. Good evening, guys. Uh, just trying to find the game at the moment, waiting for the, the players to start. And we'll be off. And I don't see the game at the moment. I'm just going to quickly refresh. Feels like I'm waiting in a car with Vodafone. <laughs> How very dare you. How very dare you. Can you guys hear me loud and clear? Hopefully you can hear me. Let's have a look at the live chat. Testing. Uh, at the moment, can't see the players, which is a bit of a problem. 
I'll switch over here now. They're, they're throwing, but I don't know if they're throwing in the game or if this is... They seem to just be throwing 180s or 20s. I am very confused. I'm very, very confused. Are they ready? Right. Uh, a few technical difficulties. You'll have to excuse me for a moment, Jeff. Just a couple. Have a league game in a bit, so I can only stay for a bit. Hell yeah. Okay. Um, uh, I don't know if they've got word that they can start the game, but I don't think the game is started. Or if it is, I can't see. I, I can't see. Heads up on whether it started yet, Sue. I can't. I can't see it. I can't find it on Darts Counter. And yeah, we can switch over here. We can see the the guys throwing. Uh, whether or not they're actually practicing here or in the game, I can't. I can't tell because I, again, I can't find the game. But uh, they have had a go ahead to get started, so. Hopefully that'll, that'll be kicking off soon. Uh, they're, they're in the game. I mean, the game is the game is occurring as we speak. I think they're on the Bayer, which means I can't see their game. Uh, and if they're not on the Bayer, then I still can't see their game. Good evening, guys. How's it going, Darren? Uh, a few technical issues. <laughs> um, but we 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 do we do plan to have something in in the works for you. Uh, as you can see, the the plays are throwing, and it looks like they're they are in the game. Um, I just can't find the game on Darts Counter. There are three Declans on Darts Counter, but I don't know who they are. I might have to start getting these guys to add me uh, before the game so I know the profiles that we're looking for. And um, Yeah. We don't have technical issues. No idea what you're talking about. Yeah, technical issues do not exist. It's absolutely correct. Thank you for the shares, guys. Appreciate that. Uh, and the likes as well. Thank you for bearing with us uh, whilst we get this sorted. Yeah, if, if you if you could add me, uh, I'd appreciate it. That, like I say, as, as long as I can see who you guys are, uh, it will make my life a lot easier uh, when it comes to trying to find your games on, on Dallas Counter. But you'd, you'd think the name would stand out. I-N-N-E-S. I just cannot for the life of me find these guys. What's my darts counter? Uh, it's Chris Livingston. Well, I can copy it for you now. I'm always floating around as well if you guys ever fancy a game. But that is that is my uh, darts counter uh, name. 
Thank you very much. I received a friend request. Accept. Thank you, Brad. Uh, right, yeah, I, I can't see this game. It looks like a cracker, to be fair. There's there's a lot of big numbers being hit. Um, what's my what's my average? Uh, on darts counter, it's fifty seven. Um, but I I vary. Um, my darts is starting to pick up a little bit. Starting to get a little bit better. Have invested in some new darts. I've got the uh, the Aspinall Echoes, um, which seems to suit my throw a little bit better. Um, it's not 80 plus. No. My my average is not 80 plus. Uh, it's, I'm averaging anywhere from 70 to 75 at the moment. It seems to be consistent for me. Um, but it's that's that's in practice. Obviously, in competition scenarios, that, that could change. I've not tested it out in competition. Better with keeping a swapping, so I'm going to dart shop to find it. That's the best way to do it. Go chuck a load of darts, find ones that feel comfortable for you. Uh, if there's someone in there that knows, get a get a helping hand off them. Um, I would highly recommend that rather than just buying random darts. So, 40 is 56 last week. Hell yeah, very nice, mate. Consistent. Yeah, I mean, we can see these guys throw in. We just can't see the game. Apologies for this, guys. We, uh, we are trying to work to get this resolved. Well, the new cell looks pretty good. I'm not going to lie. Uh, deck is on the left. Uh, Inns. Is it Innes? Inns? Innes? Innes? I'm not too sure how you pronounce it. Uh, is on the right. Uh, normally, we would have the scores top and bottom. Um, but unfortunately at the moment, uh, I can't find the scoreboard. A few minor technical difficulties. Uh, I'll type it in the chat for you, Darren. Um, yeah, I can't find them on Darts Counter. Uh, that is a problem. I'm not on the beta now. I'm on. I'm on the PC. The PC version doesn't have a beta yet. So I, if if I can't, if you're not, if you're on the beta and I'm trying to watch your game, I won't be able to watch it. They could be on the beta. They shouldn't be on the beta. Um, everyone was briefed beforehand that they would need to be on the standard version for us to be able to stream it. Um, but I'm thinking that's probably why we can't see them yet at this moment in time. I mean, again, you can see the darts flying. <laughs> you can see them landing. Um, but we just can't see the scores. We can't see what they're up to. I mean, I even I deleted the beta off my phone as well because it was causing all kinds of issues when I was trying to trying to play games um, like between PC and, and my phone. So... Can't see them on the beta. I can't see them anywhere. I don't know what the bloody hell's going on. I'm just gonna scroll down the list and see what's what's cooking. See if there's anything on there. Maybe like a no, because you have to make an account. So there's. There's not even. It doesn't make any sense. I don't get it. Zero one thousand one games on the bay. It doesn't make any sense, does it? There's three games with Declan in. One against Buck. One against Isaac. And one against Lou. Oh, best of five, 1001. That's got to be it. His name's Buck. This has to be it, surely. No? Is this not it? Bloody Nora. Let me just very quickly fix this, because that is going to bug me the entire way through. 
Oh no, that's kind of decided it's going to play ball again now. Lovely. Okay, we have the stats, we have the scoreboards. Fantastic. We're on to a game. Luckily, this is 1001, so there are only two legs in. Uh, we can see a pretty even game so far. 1 1 in legs. Uh, 50 average versus 53. Uh, Declan just edging the averages there. Um, pretty good on the checkouts as well. Deck in there with a uh, one throw and one hit on the doubles. And uh, Buck there with one out of two on the doubles. I mean, you wouldn't complain at those, would you? High scores of 100 apiece. I think we're in for a good one. I'll keep this one going. Fantastic. Love it. Okay. Balance restored. Good evening, everyone. Welcome back to the ODL live. Uh... Well, that was fun, wasn't it? That was that was interesting. Uh, we'll try and keep it uh, cool and uh, calm and collected from now. Can I leave the beta to play against my opponent who isn't yet on the beta? You can. So to leave to leave the beta, you just have to delete test flight and um, and the app and just reinstall it. It takes takes a few seconds. Um, it is one way of doing it. Obviously, you, your opponent can join the beta as well. Uh, but for streaming purposes, that does cause a few hiccups for us because we can't we can't view your scoreboards. Um, but yeah, it is possible. Lovely. Okay, some uh, some nice scoring coming in there. So forty there hit by a buck. And Declan throwing now, switching down for the 19s, has landed in the 7s by the looks of things. Unfortunate. Uh, only a 32 scored. Oh, solid darts there, good 60. Then there's a little delay between the darts counter app and... Uh, the darts coming out of the board, either that or they're entering the, the score before they get there. Yeah, they are. So that's 45 there from Buck. Slowly getting down there. We're into the 300s now. Working our way towards a finish. This seems like prime opportunity for a lot of 180s to come out uh, in the 1001. You never know, we might see some here in this tournament today. We have some cracking games coming up for you as well. A uh, couple of friendlies in there. Uh, some double trouble games. We also have the ODL. Bear with. I shall find out. Oh, I can't. It's on, the, it's on Discord. I'll have to have a look in a second for you. But what I can do is read out a few cheeky notes from today's sponsors. So, as you will be aware... This is the ODL. Uh, we currently have a lot of tournaments going. Brand new website, a Discord you can join, uh, which you should be able to find on the YouTube chat. Uh, it should pop up every now and again uh, with live messages if Stream Elements decides it wants to work. Uh, if not, it's odldarts.com. Hop on there, you can find the Discord link on there as well as a few other goodies, uh, including merch. So if you are looking to pick up some ODL merch, feel free to hop on the website and check that out. Uh, Monday Madness uh, is a tournament that currently runs, well, you've guessed it, on a Monday. That's a 301 double in team tournament. Actually, I believe that's a singles tournament now, isn't it? It's changed over. Uh, I need to get that updated on my notes. As we look at the finishing here, Declan wants eight, uh, but back on 66. Which route is he going to take? He's gone for the 16s. I think he's hit the treble 16 there. It's a very good first start. Uh, and he's into the double 14. Now, if my math is correct, that's too much. That is too much. That's unfortunate. Declan now wants double four. Ooh, I can't tell from here, but that looks bloody close. Oh, he's just straight into the four section. We'll be coming back for double two. That's if Buck doesn't check this out. 66 required. He's gone the same route again. Wants double nine. Agony on the wire. But the hard part done. If he does get another chance at that double nine, he'll know exactly where to aim now. That was a great last start. Unfortunately, just on the wire. Oh, and 
Declan not messing about there. First start straight into the double two. Takes legs two to one. Into the fourth leg here. Declan to throw first. That's a break of throw. And is much needed. In a long format game like this, you kind of want to be breaking early, get that momentum, and you can really settle in. A solid ton to start. Buck needs to respond. And if you're going to respond, uh, a treble 20 does help. Oh, he's dialed. Is that another treble 20 in there? 85. Certainly is. Yeah, it looks like the commands aren't working for uh, for Streamlabs. I don't know why. Uh, stream Elements, sorry. I'll have to hop on there and, and get that working. Uh, we didn't get to do a test, uh, uh, test stream for that one. Uh, but we may just need a, a quick tweak. Anyway, back to my uh, frequently uh, repeated broadcast. Uh, Monday Manor, 301 Dublin Tournament. Uh, Tuesday Turmoil, 701 Best of Three Bracket Tournament. Big Fish Wednesday. Uh, and that is actually today. Big Fish Wednesday is happening tonight. You may get to see some of those games later on. It's a seven, uh, 170 Best of Five. It's the biggest finishing darts, 170. I wonder if we'll see one of those. Uh, Thursday Throwdowns, a 401 Double In Bracket Tournament. And Sunday, Fun Day, 101 Quickfire Best of Nine. Uh, this tournament here is the Mountain Tournament. 1001 Best of Five, sponsored by Mickey Dunn, uh, who has become a member of the team here at ODL as well. Great guy. Uh, go check him out on TikTok, make some good content over there. It's definitely worth a, a cheeky look. Uh, also, Season 2, sponsored by Mission Darts, is well underway. How did your first games go in this season? Uh, did manage to pick up a 7-0 win of my own. Uh, unfortunately, my opponent had a few too many bevies the night before and conceded uh, the game after I checked out 109, which I might add, I was quite pleased with. Uh, again, five nightly tournaments, which have just gone through there. That's exactly what you want. Plenty of practice opportunity for you. Uh, that's what these guys have been joining in on. Getting themselves well and truly ready for the big tournaments like this. That's what you want. Uh, also, like, share, subscribe, and leave a comment. Why not? Get involved. Join the ODL. You can join via the website. As I say, the link on there for the Discord uh, is the quickest way into the ODL and the way to get into... Uh, the tournaments and uh, the league uh, league is underway so if you do want to join join the reserves list people do drop out it happens and you could be involved in this season's tournament but worry not if you do not make into the season's tournament they do start every couple of months um, and sign up will be released towards the end of the current season miss 60 doubles on your game just now wow that uh, that's a lot of doubles missed Holy, Darren lost 7-2. There's been a lot of big score lines. That has. That has been a lot of big score lines, I've noticed. I'm currently top of my uh, my division. I don't know how long that's going to last. I do have my game on Friday uh, against Sean Martin. Uh, I also have um, my semi-final pre-season cup against Toby McLeod, in which I think I'm probably going to get a spanking. Very, very good player, Toby. I believe he's in Division 2. So, yeah. That, that'll be an interesting one. If anyone is looking for some uh, <laughs> a good laugh, then you know maybe check that out. Uh, but we are currently looking at a mismatch in scores here. Declan on 170. Would love to see this go. Uh, but back on 405. So he's got a little bit of breathing room here uh, as they whittle down the scores. No pressure. Would love to see it. That's not going to happen this throw. But just pegging the score down. Let's go to 41, 129 when he comes back. Buck now needs a treble this visit. He has to get one, surely. That's a good start. Some beautiful darts. I think that's 95. It is 95. He needed that very much. That's a little bit more pressure now on Declan. He's come down for the 19s, but has landed in the 7. Uh, not too sure what he hit there. It did look like it was in the seven, but well, maybe not. Okay, book there with a solid 60. Uh, definitely 70 left. 
He's gone treble 10 for tops. He's, I'm not too sure what route that's... And I don't know if it's just me, but I can't see which route he's gone there for that 70. If anyone has any insight, feel free to let me know. We'll be wanting 31 when he returns to the board. Ah, oh, it's a beautiful, beautiful visit there. Another 60. Just knocking up them 20s. Has he gone 15 for double eight? I think that's in the 11. It is. That's... Oh, it's in the 8, apparently. Hmm. 8 when he returns. The book now for 149. Obviously, it is check. Uh, it is a, a possible checkout, but he's not going to get it this time around. Only 43 scored. Declan now with darts in hand. And he doesn't make mistakes when he's got three for the double. Second one in there. Beautiful dart. Very nice. It is, it is quite difficult to see from, from that angle, but that's going to do it. That's a win for Declan, averaging 55.27 to Bucks 52.9. Uh, pretty solid on doubles, 20% all round. Uh, I'm not going to lie to you, that was an interesting game. It's the first 1001 I've ever seen. Uh, it looks like a, a, a slog, I'm not going to lie. Got to be on the point with your scoring. Uh, 51 darts and 56 darts. Uh, the best and worst leg there for Declan and a 53 dart leg in there for Buck as well uh, we do have some more games coming up I'm just going to double check on the uh, people up next wonderful okay we're just going to get the players into the live stream channel and get them set up on the cameras and then we'll be good to go it's Brad and Darren up next. Let's get the camera set up and ready and rocking. Oh, Michael's confused himself. Uh, okay, players are just getting in there, ready to set up now. Uh, Brad is in. Let's have a look, see if he's got his camera going. He has. What a beautiful picture there, Brad. Very nice. You're not on the stream, don't worry. You don't have to duck out of the way. Uh, just getting his camera up, set up on the board. Obviously, you guys can't see this, but I'm in for a treat. Uh, right, where are we? Lovely. That's a good angle. And we've got a Rangers surround on this one. Any Celtic fans in the building? Not that I obviously want to cause any controversy, but I can't help myself. I'm a United fan. I did get the full three points for that game, yeah, so, yeah. Okay. Just bear with me two seconds. Just getting everything set up and raring to go. Big Mac is coming up, absolutely. I'll tell you what, I'm excited for this one. Good evening, Dylan. Hello, how are we? Yes, the 27th is uh, Saturday, I believe. Saturday at 9pm, League of Champions final. I'm not going to lie to you. That proves to be one of the best finals I think I'll ever get to stream. We have some heavy hitters in that one. Some very heavy hitters. Well, good. Who's talking on behalf of the ODL? My name's Chris. Uh, I've done a couple of streams for the ODL so far. Uh, also known as the Moist One. Uh, that's a name I've uh, come to accept, I guess, uh, by Harvey. <laughs> um, yeah, I'll be commentating over the games for this evening. Hopefully you guys are comfortable. Grab yourselves a beer. Or if you're not old enough, grab yourselves a juice or something. Uh, get comfy and settle in. The players are almost ready and raring to go. Brad's all set up now. Chucking some darts at the board and there's Darren. I do like Darren's setup. I'm not going to lie to you. That looks bloody good. That looks good. Look at that. Oh. That's the dream right there. I could do with a setup like that. Great stuff. I say we'll get the players ready and then we'll, we'll be able to... Uh, we'll be able to get the show on the road. 
video cutter who's talking on behalf of ODL. Uh, my name's Chris. Uh, I, uh, <laughs> I'm not going to say it again. Uh, my name's Chris. Uh, I've commentated over a few ODL games. Uh, you'll have probably heard my voice if you watched any of the videos. Uh, losing my marbles at Lee hitting 180s and Darren's insane checking out and high scoring uh, and some other cracking games uh, that we've had on live so far. Uh, I'll be doing a few more of these as long as you guys like to keep me around. Uh, and yeah, hopefully we have some fun. Players just warming up now. Uh, I am pretty much good to go if they are as well. Uh, just need to get them... Uh, loaded, so Darren. That's not Darren. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Darren and Brad. Let's see if Brad's up there. Yep, yeah, so without further ado, I am good to go. Players are warmed up, throwing some cracking darts. Uh, and we're pretty much ready, I think. Okay, I'm just going to serve and mute them on this one, just for the time being. Uh, just so... Obviously, any unexpected noises don't come through. And we'll just wait for them to start throwing the first darts. That should give us an indication on when they're live and ready to go. Got both of my ODL games on Saturday because I'm doing my week. Uh, and whoever I placed in. Oh, I see. Who have we got here? We have Darren and uh, Brad. I'm just waiting for the, the game to start now. If I can find Darren on the live. Um, or Brad or either one of them. Which you can't at the moment. But they'll. Uh, I imagine they'll be going shortly. Yeah, I've, I've commentated over one of uh, Darren's games before. I've not seen Brad play yet, but I can safely say that you're in for a treat watching Brad. Uh, uh, Darren. Uh, I get Brad could be an absolutely fantastic player. I've just not had the pleasure of watching him throw darts. Um, but Darren throws some incredible darts. Whew, I'm just waiting now, ready to go. I'll just keep searching, waiting for them to pop up on a darts counter. Uh, for the scoring. That's not Darren's house. It must be out. I mean, it's a cracking setup. I know I'm used to his, his board and then the, the mirror. But that, I really do like that. That is, that is brilliant. He's at BVD Darts. Oh yeah, you can see the logos on the bottom. Oh, fantastic. A great advertisement for them. I mean, anyone throwing darts like that, never gonna be a bad thing. Okay. So just waiting on the players to be ready. I'm just going to switch screens again real quick, just so I can have a look in the Discord and see what's going on. Okay. 
That's BBD Dart Shop in Northern Ireland. He's good mates with the owner. Very nice. Hell yeah. All right. Again, just bear with me trying to find the... That's good. It's amateur hour here. It's amateur hour, boys and girls. Bear with me. Whilst I get everything looking sharp and shiny again. Yeah, I can't find the guys at the moment. Not sure where Brad is. I'm seeing a dance thrown by Brad for a, for a hot second. Oh, wait, has Brad left? Oh, Brad's camera's gone off. And he's back. Okay. Invite's not came on. Uh, I can see you, bud. Yeah. I can see you. I don't know if there's... There's an invite on there. So I'm guessing you're using two devices, right? I'm going to assume you're using two devices. So the second device is what you're, you're scoring on, and obviously you've got your, your darts count one as well. Yeah, if you, if you can see him, drop him an invite, Brad. That's bored one. Thank you, Zavia. Great information. Thank you for sharing. <clears throat> Thank you for the new follow as well and the gifts. Do appreciate that, guys. Welcome on in. Uh, just waiting for the place to to get started. A few little hiccups, uh, a few technical difficulties, but we will we will get there. Uh, if you could, Paula, that would be a, a massive help. Uh, thank you. Uh, seems to be it's more than likely just a a technical issue down down the middle there between Dart's counter and whatnot. Apparently the invite hasn't popped up for Brad now. Oh, have we lost cameras? We've lost one of the cameras. We'll very quickly switch over to this screen just so you guys can see what's going on. Uh, once the cameras are sorted and we're back and we're gone we never said there weren't going to be teething problems that's uh, it's part and parcel with anything that's new uh, but we will be up and running shortly we're not used to doing this through Discord. We usually use Darts Counter, uh, but with the beta uh, not being able to be streamed through the website at the moment, uh, it is causing a few few hiccups, uh, but we're working around it. We have managed to find a solution uh, that hopefully works for everyone. Uh, and we should be good to go in just a moment. That's where Naka's super. Naka is fantastic as a scoring app. Uh, but I believe you can't watch other people's games on NACA. Which is where the, the problem herein lies. Um, so yeah. Admin can? I don't think... I, can we get an admin privilege on, on NACA maybe? I mean that would be nice. That would be handy. I kind of had it last week. Interesting. 
Oh, maybe something to look at. How's the games going? The first game was fantastic, yeah. Uh, we're just having a little bit of a, a technical issue uh, trying to get this game started. Uh, the invites aren't going through on Darts Counter, I don't believe. Wait, hang on. We're in. We're live. It's good to go. Let's go, folks. So, Brad on the left. Darren on the right. This is Mountain 1001. Uh... And his best five legs. Let's do this. Good start for both players. Very nice. Oh, that looks like a treble to me. That looks like it could potentially be a 140. Oh, it's a ton. Solid. Lovely stuff. Expected this from Darren. Some very high hitting darts. Uh, again, I've not watched Brad play yet, uh, but he does look like a good player. I'm excited for this one. This could be fun. Kizra was playing, had an awful setup. Measure, uh, message League admin, and he came in and was able to chat. Oh, I see, yeah, I see what you mean. So, yeah, I'd have to have admin privileges to be able to view the games. So it wouldn't just be your game, it'd be multiple games obviously being streamed. And as long as I can see the cameras and I'm able to access that. Was that 180? That was the first 180 of the evening, scored by Brad in quick fashion. Unbelievable. That came out of nowhere. Brad's stats do look long, but when you're hitting 180s with them, can you really knock them? Unbelievable scenes. He looks to be filling the bed up again. Oh my word, what are we witnessing? Is that a second 180? It's nice, a 140. 180, 140 back to back. I think we're in for a cracker. I think we're here for a brilliant match. Oh my word. He's absolutely not Darren for six. I mean, Darren's not, not exactly throwing bad darts. He's opened up with some great scoring, but Brad has just... Oh, he's in it again. He's in the treble again. Oh, that's beautiful. Is that another 140? It's a ton. 180, 140, ton. Those were Brad's last nine darts. Darren needs to fill that bed now. He's done a bloody good job of it. Let me tell you. Solid darts there. Okay. 83. Looking at averages of 93 from Brad at the moment. And 76 from Darren. This is a long format game. This isn't going to be over quickly. There's still plenty of opportunity for these guys to, to step up and, and hit some more 180s. I'm being greedy now. I know, I, I realise I'm being greedy. But who doesn't want to see a 180? Solid dance from both players so far. Darren will look to fill up that bed a little bit more, though. He is used to hitting big, big numbers. That 95 will definitely help. But can Brad keep the pressure up? Switched into the 18s there. Is that 96, potentially? 82. Eighty-two. Uh, I'm not too sure how it's eighty-two. Could be a miscount on that one. Does it look like treble twenty eighteen eighteen? I could be wrong. Solid 60 there from Brad. Once 160 on his return. Darren back on 328. Uh, this is Mountain Cup, this, Mickey. This is the Mountain Cup. So, 
what better time to give a rundown of how this works. The Mountain Tournament 1001 Best of Five, sponsored by our very own Mickey Dunn, uh, recently joined the team over at ODL. Uh, you can drop him a follow on his TikTok. does make some cracking content. Would highly recommend going and checking it out if you're into a bit of darts. That was treble 20, 18, and a 4. That makes more sense for an 82. I think it's the long points. Might be just throwing a, a little bit off on the uh, on the image over here. Solid darts there from Darren. 120 required from Brad. Darren back on 128. That 140 is putting right back in the mix. Oh, is this tops for the leg? It was an attempt at tops. I think that's single one. Yep, that's 81. Unfortunate there. Just a little shy of that 20. Darren now on 128. Oh, he went for it. He did go for it. Good darts. 57. And Brad now on 39. That's 19 for double 10 and hits it. Beautiful dart into the double there. 19 double 10 finish. Not messing around. And we're off the mark. Brad takes the lead in this one. One leg to nil. Darren opening the uh, scoring with a 60 there. All darts hitting the 20. What can Brad produce? That comes down for the 17s. Some solid darts there, 57 to open. Oh, that. That's 55, that's unfortunate. I may need a third monitor at this rate. Because the screen I'm watching on is considerably smaller than the ones that you guys are seeing. I can promise you that. Some good darts there, though. Solid ton from Brad. Uh, nice switch to the 19s. 59 scored. Both players going steady here in the 70s on the average uh, front. 78.9 for Brad. 73.6 uh, for Darren. Solid stuff. Darren yet to hit 180, but Brad... Nailing that 180 early on in the leg. That was a real treat. Okay. So, I was just saying a little bit earlier. If you do want to get on, on the action, this is the Mountain Cup 1001 Tournament Best of Five. Uh, you can join the Discord. Head on over to the website, odldarts.com, uh, if you are looking to maybe purchase some merch, join in some, uh, some buying tournaments as well, where you can win some prizes uh, and some uh, uh, cash money at the end if you are good enough to get to the finals. Uh, the Season 2 sponsored by Mission Darts is well underway now. First week games are completed or should be completed for the most part so you'll see your league table and how it looks after that first week if you are lucky like i was uh, you may be top uh, if unfortunately it wasn't a good week there's always next week it's the beauty of darts there's always another game again that's sponsored by mission darts you can check out mission darts on their socials it's at mission darts on instagram at mission darts on x formerly known as twitter and Mission Darts on YouTube. Go check out Andy Cornwall and the boys for some great darting tips. As we rejoin the action here, Darren with a slim lead in this leg. Uh, 501, uh, sorry, 503 to 608. Oh, some solid darts there from Brad. Puts him back in touching distance. This one's not over by a long stretch. Oh, but that, that could, that could open up a bit of a gap. 
It's a one two, uh, 180 from Darren. The first 180 for Darren in this game. The second one in the game in total. Beautiful darts there from Darren as he carefully removes those from the board. I'm sure that'll have made him happy to no end. Fantastic stuff. What's Brad got in response? Solid ton. Solid ton. Come on, give us back-to-back -back 180s. Oof, not to be this time. Two 180s already. I sense there's more involved in this. As Brad hits back there. Uh, only managing a nine, unless that's a typo. Okay, time to put the hammer down, Darren. 134 required when he returns. That's a good 94. Great visit. Brad now needs some trebles. Uh, it's not to be on that visit. And Darren now with 134 to check out. This is in his wheelhouse. He can do this. It's a great second dart. Switching over to the 18s there. 56 scored. 78 when he returns. Brad back on 379. Uh, Darren has stepped up his averages in this game so far. Uh, he was in the 70s. He's now into the 80s again. Uh, again, I've seen Darren throw uh, and play. Uh, this is pretty standard. Uh, a little slow off the line today, but making up for it now. It's an 80 average. And some beautiful darts there. That is, that's how it's done. 18, 20, double tops. It's now one apiece in legs. Both players managing to hold their throw. And Brad now to throw us off in this third leg. This game's got some twists and turns in it. And it is proving to be a, a cracker. If you look to get some practice done or even join in some tournaments and maybe pick up some ranking points yourself. There are plenty of tournaments and practices throughout the week to get involved in. Uh, Monday has Monday Madness. That's a 301 tournament. Uh, Tuesday has t Tuesday Turmoil. That's 701, a best of three bracket tournament. Big Fish Wednesday, which is happening as we speak. Uh, some games going down for Big Fish Wednesday. That's 170, best of five. Biggest checkout in darts. And uh, Thursday Throwdown's a 401 double in bracket. Uh, but if weekend action is more your thing, Sunday Fun Day is a 101 best of nine. That's a quick fire tournament if I've ever seen one. Get yourselves involved. And as I've been speaking through that, Darren hits another 180 to open up that leg. We're not going to see a nine data in a 1001, but that is a great way to open up your account. Unbelievable stuff. That's two in this match now for Darren uh, and one for Brad. Three 180s scored. We're in dreamland. As Darren looks to open up an early scoring lead in this leg. And really put his foot down in dominance. Solid 60. What can Brad produce? A solid scoring for both players. They don't really stray too far outside of the, uh, the big numbers, which is nice. I wish I could say the same for my game. Unfortunately, that's not the case. Great switch into the 19s there. 97. Now you feel you have to start seeing some trebles here from Brad. If he's going to stay in this leg. Oh, that is unfortunate. Very unlucky last start there. Just bounced out of what I can only imagine is the treble. Only 80 scored. He would have wanted that 140. Well, obviously he would have wanted the 140. I don't know anyone who wouldn't. Oh, he's come across to the 18s there. That's 84 scored. It's unfortunate. Just drifted into the four. Good scoring again from both players. I mean, 88, av uh, 83 average now from Darren climbing as this match goes on. And I'm not too shabby. 68 from Brad as well. Brad's not throwing bad darts. He's throwing very well. He's just being outscored at this moment in time by Darren. That's a great last dart. 96, I believe. Good darts there. And a pretty commanding lead in this one. 
270 points the difference. And that's another bounce out off the dart. Really unfortunate stuff there uh, from Brad. You don't normally get that two throws in a row. You got to feel for the man. As Darren looks to put his foot down now and clean up on this one. Another ton scored. Average ever, ever steadily climbing into the 84 range. That's a good response, that though, from Brad. Sometimes it can knock your confidence if you do have a couple of bounce outs, but he's responded well there, found the treble again. Uh, Darren looks like he's in his groove, though. It's another ton scored. 224 when he comes back. We'll be looking to get himself onto a finish on this next visit. Another good visit from Brad there. Ton scored. I mean, even if he is just slightly out of range of this match at the moment, in, this moment in time, it's never over. And that is a Robin Hood. Okay. Balance restored. That's a Robin Hood. Ah. Uh, unfortunate. That is a stolen. The 180 from our viewing pleasure. But the Robin Hood's pretty good as well. For us, not so much for Darren. It's a good 120 though. As Brad matches that with the 94. 104 required. 20. He's come across for the 18s. And drops down for the 10s. Well, maybe in 15 though. Hard to see from here. Yeah, it did just drift into the 15s. 51 when he returns, though. He does have a, a commanding lead. So I don't think that'll worry him too much. Oh, but can we see another 180? Is that in? Is that all three? It's a ton. It looked like all three from here. But I am completely blind. I'm just going to turn the music down ever so slightly because that's quite loud. Seem to be getting louder and quieter uh, as the music goes on. Uh, good visit from Darren. He does leave a one dart finish now. As Brad does his best to try and whittle this number down and give himself a chance at a finish if the opportunity does arise. Only 40 scored. Oof. Unfortunate. It's come inside that five there, Darren. He disappointed himself knowing how he can throw. No other chance here, Brad. It's a good first start to, to get this going. Yeah, yeah, again, a solid ton. 144 if he gets a chance. It looks like double one for Darren. And that's in. Treble one, double one. We'll see off that leg. Squeaky bum time, if you'll excuse the phrase uh, for a second there. Uh, did look like uh, Brad was closing the gap and, and maybe getting himself back into that one. Uh, but that is the break of throw that we did need to see. Uh, and Darren now two legs to one with the darts in hand. Which could be the decider. I'm sure Brad will have something to say about that though. Solid start again from Darren. 99 scored. But Darren, all, uh, Brad all over the trebles there. Great ton. Another 99. I mean, this man doesn't really have a visit without a treble in it. From what I've seen, it just seems to be consistent. And that's... That's what we'd all love to get in our games. Nice bit of consistency. Watching on as an average player, uh, looking at these two guys throwing some incredible darts. 180s galore. That's a very nice finishing. He can't help but dream about maybe getting there one day. What a slight slip there from Darren. Only 42. Can Brad punish this? Oh, that's unlucky. That is very unlucky. That's a ton scored. Oh, and he bounces right back. 
a ton of his own. Very nice grouping and consistency again coming in from Brad. That's the key, the grouping is the key. I mean, you look at these guys' darts and the points are all touching. Being able to follow that first dart is crucial in being able to score well. Lovely response there from Brad93. Great switch into the 18s. Both players pretty much neck and neck in this leg. He's managed to bounce back well from that, Brad. He, he, he did have a big deficit to, to claw back in that last leg, and he, he managed to get it get it down. So he will see an opportunity here. If he does fall behind or, or does gain a lead, that he, he may get a chance to still pull this back. That's only a 43 visit there. How can Darren punish? Switch down to the 19s. That's a good last start. Oh, it's unfortunate. It's not a good last start, apparently. I thought that was in the treble. Okay, so a lifeline there for Brad. No trebles from Darren that visit. A solid 78 from Brad there. Needed that last start in the, in the 19s. Lovely stuff. It's back in the treble bed. Just like you love to see. Uh, if you are enjoying the content, by the way, guys, and we have a couple more matches coming up for you this evening, uh, feel free to like the stream. Maybe leave a comment, subscribe uh, if you can. Uh, and share with your friends. Let them know. If you do want to join the ODL, join the Discord. You can find a link to that on the website, odldarts.com. Uh, that will be available for you. Uh, immediately. Some merch on there as well you can go and check out. Maybe pick up some ODL branding. Let everyone know you're part of the best online darts league around. Let's see some more solid scoring coming in. These players cannot be separated in this leg. It is neck and neck. Only 42 points between them. Where's Adam? I'm not too sure who Adam is, uh, Jono. That's a beautiful first start there, though, from Brad. Darren broke the throw. He certainly did, yeah, in that last leg. It was touch and go for a second, though. He was having a little bit of double trouble. Uh, but he's he did manage to secure that one. As he hits a 1-2-5, beautiful darts. Brad back on 1-8-6. We'll need trebles here. Put a bit of pressure on this 84. I have a feeling this is going to get checked out. Okay, good 96 there from Brad. Darren now, 84 required. Oh, unlucky. Very close. Now if he does get a chance, 12 is what he needs. But Brad here, going to try and check out the 90. 20 20 for bull oh he's gone for it agony just outside you have to go for it in that situation with darren on a one dart finish you have to attempt it darren now for double six and that's in beautiful first dart cracking game there between the boys the averages i mean what more can you say darren averaging 80 throughout that match check out rate of 33 percent he hit three out of his nine doubles um, 71 average oh, sorry basically 72 average from Brad uh, just not enough today but some fantastic darts from both players really good to watch absolute pleasure gents thank you very much for the game uh, and as always great ambassadors for the ODL what a cracker all right Beautiful stuff. I'm going to remove the server mute now. Okay. 
next game is Adam Rock versus... Uh, is it Vicky or is it Jamie? I think it's Jamie, isn't it? On Maybe on Vicky's account. Not 100% certain, but I guess we'll find out shortly. Oh, Adam Rock has been sent over by him. Yeah, so he'll be he'll be playing shortly. Uh, he's he's about to begin his game. Just waiting for the players to begin. Not the cracking game there. Very well played uh, by both players, uh, Brad and Adam. They can hold their uh, sorry, Brad and Darren they can hold their heads up high. Very very good game, and hitting averages I could only dream of. And believe me, I do dream of hitting those averages. Go on, Fat Rock. <laughs> Listen, I, I'm, <laughs> I'll take it. That's his nickname. I don't know. You guys know him better than I do. Okay. Just bear with me, guys. Uh, the cameras look good. Uh, the players now just waiting to get underway. Uh, let's see what's happening. DL darts on YouTube? I can't remember to save my life. Uh, anybody got the link for the YouTube? Uh, for the darts YouTube? If you could bang it in the chat for me, I'd appreciate it. And I could just copy and paste it over to the Discord. Uh, gracias. Por favor. We're almost ready to go. I do believe uh, Adam Adam versus Jamie. It's best of thirteen. Here we are. I think we're underway. Let me get this switched over for you, and we can see the action live. So it is Adam on the left, uh, Jamie on the right. As we get into this one. Adam with a little bit of a lead here. 74 required for the checkout. I've all seen some decent averages again from these players. 14-20 for tops now. Oh, he's landed in the single five. Unfortunate. Just tried to get it around that first start. That's unlucky. But that's good news for Jamie. I'll see what he can do here. I'll be looking for one of those big trebles. Good 98 there. Great darts. And now 35 required. Oh. Maybe some nervy darts in this first leg. Because that's a stray one there from Adam. Five if he gets a chance. I get the feeling Jamie will want to check this out. He's hit six though. He's gone down for seven. Back up for tops. One dart at it. He's hit the 20. Double 10 if he gets a chance to come back to this one. Adam now, one for double two. He's hit the one. Excellent little bit of uh, adjustment there. Online Darts League on the surround, as you can see. 
and unfortunate. But that is clinical from Jamie. Second dart into the double there, 10 taken out, and an early one leg lead for Jamie in this one. Early break, that is always nice. That can settle the nerves. We we'll need to see some big arrows here from Adam coming back into this one. Jamie opens it up beautifully there with a 99. Great darts. I think the camera froze a little bit there for, for Jamie Not on the Discord front. Welcome back, Dylan. Okay. Some solid scoring coming out from both players. I do like this. I'm switching down to the 18. Does manage to find it with the last start. It's a good treble. You have to feel that was needed. It's Jamie now looking to basically pack out the 20s and the 19. 137. Beautiful switching on the 19. It leaves 210. Some cracking darts there from Jamie. Pressure on now. It looks like the pressure may have got to him. Only an 11 from Adam. Back on 316. Jamie now looking for a commanding lead. A hold of throw, but a two leg lead early on in this game. So best of 13. So it will be going uh, the distance, uh, I feel. Well, obviously it's going to go the distance. We're going we're gonna to see at least seven legs. I'm going to stop talking for a second. See Adam back on the board now. Good ton. Solid score there. Needed that one. We'll just see a couple of stray darts there from Jamie. That's only 30. An opportunity now for Adam if you can find the treble. Just covered the 19s, unfortunately, there, and straight into the three. Only 42 scored. Jamie now with a 106. It's a great first start into the six. Up for tops. Oh, agony. Just low again on that 20. It's the second dart we've seen at the 20 that has dropped a bit low on the double. But uh, he is going to get a visit back to the board on this. He's already hit a double 10. Uh, can he do it again? As I say that, great darts there from uh, from Adam. Beautiful 86. Just at the right time. May put a bit of pressure on this one. Uh, as Jamie now needs fives. Good marker. And that second one is in. There we go. And a second leg to Jamie just... Edging the score in there on this one. Great darts. That's 2 0 in legs. And Adam now out with a point to prove. Only 44 scored. And again, Jamie looking to punish. And 45. Both players settling into this one. The way Jamie took the darts out of the board there, he wasn't happy with that. And rightly so, he's a good darts player. He won't be happy with the 45. Probably saw an opportunity to capitalise, and Adam's done exactly that. Solid 99. Put the pressure back on Jamie. Oh, unfortunate there. 42 scored. Opportunity now. It's not going to be a breaker throw. It would be a holder throw if you can cling on to this one, but... Uh, it rightly sows up. It is a marathon and not a sprint. With seven legs being the magical number here. And we will get a, a winner here. There's no draws. Uh, we're going to see someone take this match. Some great arrows there from Jamie. Good last. Finds the treble 19. That's a 1 2 2. Trouble 5, trouble 20, trouble 19. Uh, I assume. Oh, it can't have been. It must have been single 5. Still 1 2 2 scored. Only 30 there from Jamie. I don't know, with an opportunity to, to take a leg back. 56 scored, 95 when he returns. Trouble 19, double 19, the. Optimal choice for a two-darter. The only choice for a two-darter, I guess. Unless you go 
triple 15 bull. Okay, he's come back up to the 20s. Nice. Again, no pressure on this. He has darts in hand to be able to, uh, to get this down to a, a decent finish. Didn't have to go directly for the 19s. Well, 60 scored will help. See some trebles here now from Jamie to bring him on to a finish. Uh, that's unfortunate. Only 45. No outshot on 165 there. 164 or 167 he would have wanted. That's a good dart there from Adam. Three, double 16. Gives him a leg on the board and a cracking finish. All right, this game's not over yet. Jamie with darts in hand. Let's see what he can do. A little low into the 20. Good correction, though. Great treble on the finish. Uh, sorry, finish on the finishing dart. Words are all over the place this evening. Uh, 57 there from Adam. Seeing the players uh, covering the treble bed quite a bit here. Having to switch all the way around to the 18s. Solid 60 from Jamie. That's a good last start. 100 scored and you feel was needed. Very nice 59. Just found the treble 7 there instead of the treble 19. But it doesn't hurt. But Jamie has the darts in this leg and has already broken. So Adam does need to break back uh, in this one to stand a chance of winning. A little pause here on the Discord front. Just show what's going on with the camera. Uh, it's unfroze again. We're good. Oh, a little bit of lag from both ends. Is that me? Nope. It seems to be good on my end. I'm not too sure what's happening. Very interesting. Let's get back into this one. All players averaging in the 60s. Some really consistent darts going down here. And 66 there from Jamie. I have now 269. He wants to travel to get himself on a finish. Well, that's not going to be possible now. And now the cha uh, chance for Jamie to steal. Well, I say steal this leg. It is his darts, but... feel like this would be a very good leg to win. It's only early in the match. There's still a long way to go in this one, but a two-leg lead is always a comfortable one. Good last, 78 scored. No out shot. But it does apply a little bit of pressure. Went for the ball there. 48, 82 when he returns. Had him back on 166. We'll want to get this down to a two dart finish if he can. And he does just that. Good darts there. Very nice darts. As Jamie opens up with a 25. Now he has a choice. He's going to go for another 25 for a 16. It's risky. Obviously, he could hit the ball. He's gone 17 for tops, which is the correct route. Beautiful darts there. Absolutely sensational stuff. An 82 checkout from Jamie. Puts him three legs to one. It's a hold of throw, but that will feel huge with that big checkout. And that seems to have rocked Adam a little bit. He only manages a 26 on that throw. Jamie now to throw. He's in the trebles, I think. Oh, he's just above the trebles. I think he's had a bounce out on that one. Only 40. You have to feel the nerves are maybe playing a little bit of a part in this one as well. We're looking at a close game here. That is coming down to a fight on the doubles. And, and Jamie's just edging at the moment with nearly 40% on his doubles. Because the scoring's fairly even. Pretty much par for the course. As I say that, Jamie tags a, a ton there. 
solid, solid darts. Ball play starting to settle into this. A bit of consistency going down. Also finding the treble 20 and the 20s a lot more. How's everyone's evening going? Hopefully you're enjoying the content. Got a couple of games already this evening. Uh, we're looking to, to get another one at least out for you here. Um, this is a best of 13 legs. Jamie currently with a 3-1 lead. If you're looking to get involved in the action, you can do so by joining the ODL. Uh, you can access the link through the website, odldarts.com. Hop on over there, have a look around. Uh, it is a work in progress. There will be league stats and stuff on there eventually. Uh, but for the time being, there is a merch shop. Uh, sorry, time being, there is a merch shop. Go and pick up a few bits and pieces. Rep the ODL. Show your pride for this amazing, amazing community. Uh, if you're looking for a few practice tournaments, you can also get involved uh, in Monday Madness. That's a 301 double in tournament. Uh, Tuesday Turmoil has 701 at best of three brackets, a longer tournament. Uh, if you're looking for something with a, a lot of opportunities for getting 180s potentially. Uh, Big Fish Wednesday, 170 best of five. That is on this evening. Uh, and we may get a chance to check in on one of those games a bit later on. Uh, Thursday throwdown 401 double in bracket and Sunday fun day if the weekend stuff is more your thing. Uh, that's a 101 best of nine, pretty much quick fire tournament. Uh, better be on your best with your doubles that day. Uh, the mountain tournament 1001 best of five. That tournament is sponsored by Mickey Dunn. Drop him a follow on TikTok. Uh, you can go check out his content. He does make some cracking stuff, uh, including darts videos. Uh, if so, if you are interested in darts, which I would imagine you are since you're here. That could be just up your street as we see adam try and check out 60. uh did just miss the double 10. may get an opportunity to come away he's definitely going to get an opportunity now to come back for the double five how do we join so if you go to the website www.odldarts.com hop on there you'll find a link to the discord uh, you can join the discord and everything that happens odl happens through the discord uh, another way to access it would be to go and follow on Facebook. Uh, that's ODL Darts, Online Darts League on Facebook. Uh, and you can also follow on YouTube uh, and TikTok. Uh, it's ODL Worldwide on TikTok. And as you're currently commenting on YouTube, drop a subscription here as well and a like. But yeah, if you are looking to get involved in some darts, online darts content, this is the best way uh, to do it. As we do see a checkout there from Adam, a hold of throw. Uh, which you feel if he'd been broken again, it may have been too much of a mountain to climb. Uh, but good darts. Uh, as Jamie kicks us off here with a solid 60. Okay, a little bit of camera pausing going on again on Discord. Lovely stuff. Great darts there from Adam. He's bounced back well from that break of throw. Jamie now looks to take out a ton of his own. I said this a little earlier, but both players really warming into this game now. Giving us a bit of a spectacle to watch. The games have been chosen this evening to give you guys a treat uh, in terms of what the ODL can really offer uh, and what you can expect from the players here in this league. Uh, as Jamie hits 93. Uh, on 2 4 8 after 9 darts here. Some really good scoring. And he's back up there into the 20s again. I think he senses blood. Because that is another ton. Beautiful darts from Jamie. Adam back on 3 2 1. Maybe shell shot from this one. But has an opportunity here for a 180. And I think he's filled the bed. That's 3 in the board. 180. Put him right back in his leg. Talk about timing. That is sensational. Adam with a 180. Beautiful stuff. Unbelievable darts there. Jamie needs to hold his nerve now after that. Because Adam is right back in this one. Once 141. Can he check it out to follow up? That would be unbelievable. He's not going to check it out. But I imagine that's giving him a little bit more confidence. 
as he tags a 60 at 81 if he does get a chance to come back to the board jamie will want to check this out he's gone down for the 19s he's hit treble seven Oof, that is unlucky very close there uh, 43 scored uh does want 60 i don't know 72's come up for 12s uh, that's unfortunate he's gone down for 17s now okay 38 that's not too bad that's fine uh, sorry 41 uh, that's not too bad if he does get a chance to come back from this he'll he'll hopefully uh hit the double but two darts in hand oh, that's double one i believe down for 19. oh agony wrong bed oof maybe a chance missed here as adam with three darts in hand hits the 21s double 10. is that in it looks good for me it's not it's just on the wire oh so close discord link isn't working on the website i will grab you the link just after this connor uh fret not i will find it absolute agony uh from jamie as well uh just missing out on the eight. Oh my word and he's bossed he's bossed I was almost too quick to process that one. Went for double five, hit single, went treble one for double one. And that'll seal it. Jamie there, four legs to two. He's gone with the throw the entire way through, apart from that first leg where Jamie broke. And he's, he's just holding his throw. Uh, a little bit of a scare for him there, but he's, he's managed to pull through. And, and again, the doubles are really telling the tale. Almost, well, more than double the percentage on checkouts for Jamie than, than Adam at the moment. Scores for show, doubles for dough is the, the old slogan. Uh, but that's definitely not going to hurt a 140 for Adam opening up in this leg. Closely followed by a 93 by Jamie. Okay. Can he find a treble? Oh, just a bit low for the treble there. Good 60 though. straight out into the three and 27 scored an opportunity now for jamie to potentially break again oh what a way to do it finds the treble good hundred there need to see some solid scoring here from adam otherwise jamie's in danger of stealing this throw and that's what we needed we needed that last start in there beautiful Jamie knocking on the door, but Adam's closed it in his face. It's only a 41 there from Jamie. It would have been nice to see him fill the bed. Uh, as we get towards the deciding legs here, it looks like both players maybe just wavering a little bit. Uh, the average is starting to drop a touch. Maybe nerves setting in. A few stray darts go back and forth. Oh, that's great. He switched down to the 19s. Maybe feels a bit more comfortable down here. Oh, that's a good last. Very nice darts there. 96 scored. Puts him on a two dart finish. Jamie back on 164. This is possible. Oh, it's not anymore. He needed two 19s for a bull. Uh, which seems to be the preferred way of going these days. Since you don't have to do too much switching. Okay, Adam now, 18, four tops. He's come low, he's hit the 20, he wants 10s. And has hit the single 10. Jamie now with a 130. Should start in the 20s. He does, he hits the treble. He's got 70 left. He stayed up on the 20s, wants bull. Hits 25, that would have been mesmerising stuff. Oof, so close. But he has put enough pressure on this, I feel. To make this one a nervy, nervy throw for Adam. Two darts on the wire, and he's dropped low. That's going to leave him five. Jamie now with 25 to check out. Which route does he take? He went nine for 16s, but he's hit 14. So he's going to need 17 for double four. Uh, that's unlucky. A little high dart. 
Difficult to come up from uh, from 14-3 to then double four. A lot of movement on the board. Adam with a nervy dart there. Hits the one. Will we get one dart of the double? He's hit 15. That's a bust. Uh, that will need a score correction, I believe, because he, he has hit 1 and then 15. Uh, it doesn't matter. Jamie's checked it out. So it won't it won't matter on the, the score edit there. Good dart from Jamie. Very nice stuff. And that is a 5-2 league. Another break of throw. And Jamie with the darts now to really pile on the pressure. Could switch up to the 18s again. Oh, 59 there from Jamie. Solid. Adam now needs this leg. You feel this is a must-win leg. There's there's no option here. He has to break back in this leg. He's got to break back twice. If we're being realistic, he has to. If he's got any chance of winning this game. So you feel like he's got to go a couple of legs on the bounce here. I get the feeling Jamie's going to have something to say about that, though. He's not just going to roll over and let him do it. He's going to have to see some powerhouse darts here from Adam. And that's a great way to start. Good dart into the treble. I think that's a 1-2-1. One, one. It certainly is. Good response. Beautiful stuff. Thank you guys for tuning in, by the way. If you are new, feel free to hit the follow button. Uh, or subscribe if you are on YouTube. Uh, like the video and leave a comment. And share it with your friends. Let's get this video out wide for everyone to see the majesty that is the ODL. As we're watching a great game here between Jamie and Adam. It's not been a whitewash as, as much as it looks. Uh, Jamie five legs to two. They've both been in this game. They've both had chances at doubles. Just Jamie's been a little bit more clinical on the doubles at the moment. Adam is, for all intents and purposes, outscoring Jamie uh, as it currently stands. Um, although not by much. But that will definitely help. A 140. 55 remaining. Jamie back on 252. I don't think this will uh, worry him too much. As you can see, he responds with a 99. Good darts. Uh, but Adam now 55. He's hit 320. Goes to the 16s. Oof, so close. Unfortunate. 32 when he comes back. I say when, if he comes back. Because that's a good first start there from Jamie. Solid stuff. Puts the pressure right back on there. Three darts in hand for Adam. It's a good marker. Oh, it's another good marker. Come on. Just on the inside. I think that's too far inside. He may have just hit the 16. He has. Jamie now with a chance to just compound the misery. 14 for tops. Hits the 21. It's double 10. Oof. Just on the outside. And now Adam needs these darts to land. Double eight. Needs the four. Double two. Oh, he's come inside. He's on Madhouse. He's got two left. That last start was so fast. I feel more out of maybe hope than anything for that double two. As Jamie finds the double ten in one dart. And that's going to be a 6-2 lead. Adam with the darts now. Find 60. Solid opening darts there. That's cracking darts again from Jamie. One, two, five. Finds two trebles on an opener. You can't ask much more really. And this match has kind of swayed and, and tipped a little bit. What's been consistent is Jamie's doubling. 30% uh, on the double, 6 out of 20 hit. Really good stuff. As he looks to get a 180 on the board. Oof. Unfortunate. 125 followed by a 140 though. A foot on the neck of Adam here. He was trying with all his might to stay in this one. 
Jamie's doing his damnedest to make this basically the last leg. And he's finding the darts to do it. Will he switch here? Is he going to stay up there? He has switched down. Only 44. A bit of a reprieve there for Adam. That's a good switch. 82. Very nice last start into the treble 19. Jamie now on 192. Hmm. 60 solid. 132 when he returns. Not a huge fan of the ball route myself, I'll be honest, but I think it works for some players. And that's a great 134 from Adam. Talk about pressure. He's really stepped up to that one. There's a couple of shaky darts there from Jamie. Only 37. I think the pressure's been applied. Shanghai now would be beautiful. He's not going to be able to do it. Oh, that darts just bounced out of the board. That's not going to help. I think that's 24. It is. So Jamie now with the darts for the match. Um sure what he's gone for there but he's, he's got 55 so we'll leave him tops but 96 now oh unlucky 42 jamie now three darts in hand for this match double top just takes a second and composes himself throws the dart and that that looks to me like it's in and that'll do it that is in. Great dart there. And a 7-2 victory from Jamie. It looked like Adam, for for what it's worth, was out of it. But he wasn't. This was a close game. The score doesn't do it justice. That was a cracking match to watch. Uh, we had a 180 in there from Adam as well. You can take consolation from that. That was a cracking, cracking finish. Um, beautiful game, players. Uh, thank you, Jamie and Adam, for that one. As we prep for the next match. Uh, great stuff. I will grab you the link for the Discord now, folks. Just bear with me a second. Okay. I'm just going to grab the invite link for Discord. Invite people. There we go. Uh, copy. that into the YouTube so you guys can join the discord using that link uh, hop in join the community uh, get yourselves involved this will be an absolute blast let's see what's going on just waiting for the players to be ready for the next game uh, we have up next for you as I look at my little book of secrets uh, Sam against Stu so we have our fearless leader uh, versus Sam Pell this is double trouble round of 16 so it's a 301 double in best of 16 match uh, this is going to be a cracker uh, both players capable of hitting some fantastic darts and I can't wait for this one uh, the plays are getting underway at the moment so I'll wait till I see the game and then we'll be good to go Just getting themselves ready here. Bear with me, folks. Just trying to find the game as the players do set up for their match. 
we're almost ready to go. Mm, I can't see the game. Why can't I see the game? Can't see the game at the moment. Hang fire. Oh, I can see two street uh, screen is is they're not in yet. I don't think. No, the game's not started yet. That's really handy actually. I can see Stu trying to get ready for the invite now. Uh, I think we're basically ready to go. So let's get the boards up. Uh, these screens will change shortly. Um, just waiting for the place to be ready. All right. Got the cracker. So this is a double in tournament. So you will have to hit a double before your scores do count. The double that you hit does count towards your score. Uh, we'll have a little chat about that as we get into it as well. There we are. Uh, Mickey, the commands aren't working. I don't know why. Uh, and the automated messages, again, are not working. The stream elements. We didn't get a chance to test the stream, did we? Uh, before we went live. So we'll have to have a, a play around with that once I get a, a spare minute. There we go. And we have the game underway. Sue throwing on the right side, uh, Sam on the left. Uh, 301 double in tournament and we're off so as I mentioned a little bit earlier you do need to hit a double before you can start scoring it as Stu demonstrates perfectly there hits the double one but because the other two darts were before the double they don't count towards his score so that's only two points but more importantly he's off the mark and that is crucial as is Sam that last dart finding the double 16 it's good stuff from both players. So it's best of 11 legs, first to six. Uh, a Stu there in the 20s. Uh, just a straight out into the five, but he's... Uh, won't worry him too much. We'll see what the players can produce here. Yeah, so no, none of the commands are going to work there, Mickey, I don't think. I need to hop on stream elements and, uh, and have a play around with it again. Well, welcome on into the stream. Uh, Sam there with an 85. Good stuff. And Stu with 100 himself. Some good scoring going on. That's the only problem with those standalone dartboards is they do rock a little bit. And that I, I can't throw on them very off-putting for me forty one there Sam wants one oh one now just takes his time single twenty he's gone for another one and did try and switch down for the seventeens he's just missed that little bit well forty two is not gonna hurt stupid with one thirteen checkout required Trouble 15s wants a 20. Uh, trouble 5, sorry. Oof, that's unlucky. Very unlucky. Getting seasick watching it. <laughs> yeah, it's, 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 a, it's a difficult watch. I'm not going to lie. It is. But uh, that's okay. Just don't think of waves and, and the sound of the ocean. And you'll be absolutely fine. Sam there with I'm not too sure what his score was it, it's gone down as as nothing I don't think it was bossed it's two on 75 does manage a 63 we'll want double six if he does get a chance to return Sam down for 19 20 for double 10 just on the outside there so Stu now with a chance for the first leg and a break throw in the first leg. Double six required. 
It's in single six, one's double three. Is that in a three or is it in the 19? It's in the 19. That's unlucky. It's a bit weird. Glad I put my board in the wall now. Yeah. Well, that's, that's the thing. Like I say, it, it does rock a little bit. And it's hard to get it really level. Unless you're on like a concrete floor, it's, it's kind of tough. Uh, but Sam makes light work of that double 10 there. And takes the first leg. So it's going with the throw for the time being. That looks like a good tops there from Stu. Great scoring. Solid 60 to get him off the mark. Sam now pressure on. Needs a double. Otherwise he's in danger of falling behind. Some nice grouping, but unfortunately he's not found the double. The transparent uh, K-Flex on there. I always find them a bit weird. I mean, I've thrown with the transparent ones on and uh, it throws me off because I, I can't see the flight properly. Um, so it always, it kind of ruins my... Oh, Stu is here, 180. He's found it. Our fearless leader has found a 180. Three in the bed. Beautiful darts. 61 remaining. I did say to him, he said before the game, he's like, oh, I don't know if my game's up to scratch for, for playing on the stream. I said, mate, you're a 180 machine when you're on live. Hop back on. It'll happen. And what did I, what did I say? It's happened. Beautiful darts there from Stu. One. Oh, and he's, he's checked it out. That's a great leg of darts. Beautiful leg of darts there. Checks out the 61. That's what we like to see. 59 average coming out the gates and that's 1-1 one, one. that will fill in with nothing but confidence fantastic stuff I think the tripod is attached to the ball which doesn't that definitely not uh, George by the way uh, dad's trying to get in touch with you um, so you might want to check your phone sorry about that little into family stuff on the stream. Uh, Stuber edited the score to 40. He is off the mark though, so that's good. Sam tags at 95. That's a big number. We need to see some trebles here from Stu. Oh, it's just shy of the treble. 45 scored. Sam now with the advantage in this leg. I mean, again, this is going with the throw at the moment. He is popping off. He's throwing very good darts. He is. Good darts there. 83. Sam now with 1, 2, 5 left. Hit the single one. It's over for this visit, but oh, I was going to say he could probably tag that down, but a 105. The ball is now in Stu's court. 133 required. He's going to be able to check it out, but he can do some damage to this number. Okie dokie. It's 43. Sam now uh, 65 I think good darts I think it's in there anyway it could be in the 5 we'll get confirmation once the score goes in it's in the 5 not the 20 so it is uh, 32 I think he's hit the 7 there as well uh, and not the, tre uh, not the 25 let's do now 80 That's 36 scored, 54 remaining. Oh, will he get a chance or will Sam take this out? 73, treble 19. It's gone the 17's route. 56 left. 16 for tops, maybe? Oh, he tried 16 for tops. And he will get 40 when he returns. Correction, if he returns, he will require 40. But now Stu, 14 for tops. He's found the 14. Can he find the double top? It's a good marker just inside of that. That looks good, but is it? It's not. It's just on the wire. Unfortunate. 
both on tops now. Both play, uh, players requiring double t uh, 20. Just a little loose off to the right. It's 20 hit, double 10. Oh, so close. Yet so far. And I'll stay with a chance to break throw here. Double tops. It's double one down for the 19s. I think he's hit the three. Or maybe 19. Soon find out. He did, he hit the three. That's unfortunate. Good evening, Ben. How's it going, dude? Welcome on in, guys, to the stream. If you want to, feel free to hit the follow button. Uh, or subscribe if you... Uh, can on YouTube as we see Sam take out the 20 with his third dart. It's a good dart. And the legs are still going with the throw. As we get back underway here, Stu looking for a double to kick it all off again. It's just petered off a little bit this game. Uh, as both players starting to settle down now, maybe found each other's range and are looking to do some damage. That's not going to be either player off the mark at the moment. An early double here, crucial. And Stu not able to find it. At two visits. It's a good marker from Sam and he's managed to find that one. Very well thrown there. He's off the mark, 47. Stu now needing a double. He's going to stay on tops. And he does manage to find it by the looks of things. He's come across the fives. 45 scored. More importantly, he's off the mark. And that's what you want to see. Sam now returning to the board. As I am getting motion sick looking at this board going backwards and forth. Solid 60 though. And only a 9 from Stu. So an opportunity for Sam here to break. Could be the first break of the match. It's 194 needed. He's managed to get that down to a finish. 153 when he returns. And we need to see some troubles here from Stu. Is uh, back on two four seven. So I want to see at least one in the treble. That's only a twenty six. So a bit of breathing room here for Sam. Single twenty found another one. He's come down for nineteens. One of six when he returns. Now fearless leader. What can he do? That's unfortunate. 11. Back-to-back -back poor throws there from Stu. He's, he's going to want to correct that in the next one. After speaking to him, he'll, he'll be kicking himself. He knows he's he's way better than that. And he's got that in his locker. That's a great correction, though, into the 20s. Those darts are on with purpose. As Sam requiring 63 now. He's, I believe, hit the treble 13 there. He has, so he wants double 12. It's a wide dart, and that one's just inside. He is going to get to return to this one. He will want double 6 when he comes back. Stu now needs to peg this down a little bit. He's back on 169. No out shot for this one. He's going to just freely throw at the 20s. Down for the 19s. This is a good switch. Leaves him on 110. Sam now with three darts at the double. Double switch required. It's a good marker. And he uses that marker very well. Second dart into the double. And that's our first break of throw in this game. 
Sam takes the 3-1 lead. And he has the darts to throw. So Stu outscoring Sam here uh, ever so slightly. But again, with, with a lot of the matches this evening, the doubles really telling the story of this one. That's a good double, though. He's off the mark. Sam really needs a double of his own here. The scoring not really that important in the first throw. It's just getting that double. Just nailing that double to get yourself off the mark. And Sam isn't able to do that. So Stu now with a chance to break right back. Just needs to stay composed and throw some good darts. And that's a great way to start. Good grouping. Really solid stuff there from Stu. Very nice, 85. A little change of tactics there from Sam as he comes up for the 20s. Still not off the mark on a double. And a little bit of relief from breathing room here for Stu as he does find a treble there. That's lovely, good 78. So he's going to get to come back for a finish. Uh, Sam's still not off the mark. Uh, and isn't going to find a double. So perfect opportunity here. 118 required. Looks like it may be in the uh, 20s. Uh, that's unlucky. Just outside of the treble. But again, no pressure. So he's 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 got plenty of time for this. Just kind of go about this any way he wants. Uh, and that's just outside of the double as well, it looks like. Maybe just below the wire there. Can be a frustrating format, this doubling. So you could be throwing some very good darts just on the wire and, and none of them count. Stu scores 20. I want 70. Again, Sam not off the mark, so there's no pressure here. There's nothing to worry about for Stu. He just has to throw. Just just play your game. Just enjoy your game and things will work out. Uh, just having to think about what he wants to go for. That's 34, so he's on a one dart finish now. This leg almost certainly over. Um, and that's unfortunate. It's just not been Sam's leg, this one. Let's do now three darts at the double 18. Well, that could be an awkward one, that. It's a great marker with his second. Just needs to bounce off the barrel. Oh, unfortunate. But we'll get a chance to come back at this again. You've got to feel he's got at least... 9 to 12 more darts at this. Correction, make that 12 to 15 at this point. Now Sam's just a passion, uh, passenger in this leg. Uh, single one there from Sue. And he's, is that in the double? He's off the mark, it looks like. Oh, no, he's not. It's not in the double. It's just on the outside. Oh. And no score there from Sue. This is an interesting leg of darts, I've got to be honest with you. I mean, if I was in Sam's position here, I'd, I'd probably be laughing at this point. Oh, and there you go. There's the, the fingers. Uh, just as I call it, uh, he's <laughs> uh, shown exactly how he feels about that one. Uh, Stu finds the three, so we'll get 
uh, three darts at the 16. Uh, Sam's all over the board here, trying to find a double. He's switching. Is that in? Has he found it? He's not. He's not managed to find the double. That's on the opposite side of the wire. And likewise, just on the other side, uh, Stu's struggling with uh, finding finding the double 16. So we have double trouble on either end of the game here. Sam not able to get off the mark and Stu not able to close this game out. Hit 16 once, double eight. Is that in? That looks a good dart to me. It's in. He's found it. Lovely stuff. Okay. That's the leg done and dusted. There was a moment there where I thought this could go on for a little bit longer, but it's a good second dart from Stu as he looks to take out another double. He's dropped down into the trebles. I think he's found that 20. He has as well. He's off the mark straight away again. 37 scored. How could Sam find the double? Oh, we saw him have many attempts at the doubles before. That, that's not a double, I don't think. No, it's not. Surely not. Surely we can't see this happening again. He's been very good on his doubles in the first few legs. The first four legs, he was finding them very, very easily. Now he seems to have hit a little bit of a wall. Let's do open a, a gap here. Okay, where's the... Oh, Stu's camera's gone. And he's back. We're back. A little panic for a second there, but we're good. We're good. Worry not, folks. Solid darts there. Good stuff. 60, just whittling away the numbers. And Sam has found a double. He's hit the double 16. He's off the mark. He's onto the scoring. That's got to feel good. A load of relief. Sorry, all. Nothing to apologize for. It's absolutely fine. The ODL supports players of all levels in here, of all capabilities, whether that be Lee Hodgkiss, uh, all the way down to people who've never thrown a dart before. It's all good fun and it's all enjoyable. Plus you've hit a 180, so that, that, that cancels out everything else. Okay. Uh, tactical switch down to the 19s. There's good scoring there from Sam. It's a 95. So you're now on 96. Opportunity to check this out. Hit one, what's 19s? Uh, let's come back up for the 20s. That's a good switch. Okay. 56, if he gets a chance to return Sam now, wants one, five, two. Now, wouldn't we love to see this go out? Trouble 20, trouble 20, double 16 is the route. Oh, Sam editing the score to 76. That's correct, because he hit a double and then single, single. Uh, not a treble. Oh, 58. So he's taking a little bit off it. I feel the momentum's in Stu's hands here. He wants double 10. Oh, agony. Unlucky. That is unfortunate. Once double 5, if he gets a chance to come back, this would be a big shot if Sam took out the 113. He's not going to get a chance to now. Throws very quick. He has a very, very fast-paced throw here from uh, from what I'm seeing. I played against a lot of players that throw that quick, and it, it can mess with your rhythm a little bit uh, if you're playing against them, but Sue's managing quite well. And Stu's bust there, I believe, rather than going for the one double two. Uh, oh, I don't think Stu's pressed enter uh, to skip over that one. Ah, oh, there we go. No 
score just on the wire for that and Sam now wants double 15 he's going straight at it there's two on the outside he's brave with the last and that finds the double 15 that's a good dart it's a very solid dart there and a breaker throw has occurred so Sam leading 4-2 now in this best of six, uh, sorry, best of 11 legs. And there was no messing from him that time around. Does find the double first dart and has a very comfortable 72 in the bag. Stu now following suit, finds a double with the first dart. Really good stuff from both players. 96. Now we're laughing. Now we're getting going. Solid 60 there from Sam. Uh, just for anyone wondering, Sam isn't currently experiencing an earthquake. Uh, his tripod, I believe, is attached to his board stand, uh, which is where the rocking is coming from. And uh, Stunhal tags 94 as well. Really good scoring here from Stu. He's, he's really putting out some big numbers. Again, already has a 180 in this match. And Sammy's not being shy by either. He's pretty consistent around the uh, the big, big 20s and 19s. Okay, 111 required. That's his preferred route here. Looking for a treble 20. 17s. And switches over to the 14s. I think that's in the treble. It looks good to me. It's not. It's 51. But that's fine. Two dart finish coming up. Tops is going to be his preferred route, I imagine. 20 for double 20. Unless Sam has something to say about this. Oh, we needed that treble 20 there to have a chance at a double. That's unfortunate, but 58 is not a bad score. Does add a little bit of pressure to this. Stu finds a 5, wants 15, finds it. Double top, one dart. Is it in? It's not, it's just, just below. Unfortunate. Sam now with a chance. Let's take another leg. Hits the 17, we'll get two darts at tops. That's a good marker. That one's just dropped low. Watcher wasn't able to use that marker. All plays on 20. Stu with darts in hand here for this leg. And that's a beautiful first dart. Great finish in there from Stu. As he takes that leg back. And that's a break of throw back to back. And darts in hand now, Stu, to make it 4-4. That's good doubling. Very nice. So for anyone new who has joined, if you would like to get in on the action and join in some of these tournaments, you can do so by joining the Discord. You can find links to that on the website and on Facebook. Uh, Online Darts League on Facebook. And uh, the website is odldarts.com. Check it out. Some merch on there. Some uh, buy-in tournaments if you are looking to get involved in some cash prizes uh, and some other goodies. Uh, if practice tournaments and something a little bit more relaxed is your thing, uh, try out for some of our tournaments during the week. There's Monday Madness 301 Double In Tournament. Tuesday Turmoil 701 Best of Three Bracket Tournament. Uh, Big Fish Wednesday, which is today and is currently going on uh, in the background. Uh, that's a 170 Best of Five. Biggest finishing darts. Can you take out the Big Fish? Uh, Thursday Throwdown is 401 Double In Bracket. Sunday Fun Days 101 Best of Nine and Mountain Tournament, which is currently occurring, is a 1001 Best of Five. That tournament is sponsored by our very own Mickey Dunn, who's recently joined the family. Uh, drop him a follow on TikTok, go check out his content, make some darts content, some very good stuff over there. Uh, really worth a, a look. Uh, if any, anybody else would like to sponsor a tournament, you can get in touch with us at odldarts at gmail.com. Get your name down on a tournament, get some shout-outs and, and some goodies uh, as well. 
Uh, that's odldarts at gmail.com. We'll get back to you uh, as soon as possible. All right. Uh, the first league fixtures have been given out. The first week is over. Where do you stand in your league table? How did you get on this week? Let us know in the comments. Uh, I myself, top of the scoreboard, uh, top of the leaderboard. Uh, it may only last a week, but I'm claiming that right now. Um, <laughs> season 2, obviously sponsored by the wonderful Mission Darts. Uh, very gracious to those guys. Sorry, all. <laughs> He's got a pre-made sign. Bless him. He's got a pre-made sign. No need to apologise, Sue. It's darts. It is fine. <laughs> you throw me off my game now. Uh, you can find Mission Darts on their socials. It's at Mission Darts on Instagram, at Mission Darts on X, formerly known as Twitter, and Mission Darts on YouTube. Plenty of stuff over there. Uh, tips and tricks videos. There's also uh, a series where they go around checking out... Um, different hockeys and, and places where people play darts even the, the the famous darts players play darts so if you do want to check any of that out go and go and find them on the youtube really good stuff uh, from uh from the guys over there uh, but that that pretty much concludes the announcements uh that just leaves me to say like share follow and subscribe uh, if you can as we see to fight right back into this one and take that one 4-4 with a 41 check out beautiful stuff and we have a game on our hands we've had many breaks of throwing this one but it's all level again it's all following the darts as sam struggles to find a double to get off here can stu make the most of it he certainly can that looks things that is in the tw it's not in the 20 i thought that was in double 20 Bang in the middle with a draw week one, absolutely. Absolutely. And it was a cracker. Let me tell you, George, some high finishing in there. Some great, great finishes. Yeah, unfortunately, I didn't get, my, get to finish my game. It ended after two legs after I checked out 109 with a 5 treble 18 bull. Uh, Marin suddenly felt sick, as I would if someone checked that out against me. Bless him. Hopefully, he's feeling better now after his hangover. Anyway, back to the game. That's got to be in, surely. That is in. The last dart has found its mark, and that is for it to get off for Stu. Sam now needs a double. Oh, is that in the seven? It is. He's found double seven. Both players off the mark now. Lovely stuff. I am parched. I really need a drink. I'm going to have to run downstairs and grab a drink. You guys can take care of yourselves for like 30 seconds, right? I'm pretty sure. As we watch these two players battle it out. I'll be back in two seconds, guys. I'm grabbing a drink before I die of dehydration. like I never left. Ah, I'm back guys. Sorry about that. Stu now requiring 152. Not to excuse the noise, I'm about to open a can. Lovely. Takes off a 50 from that. So I'm not gonna finish so still will get a return to the board guaranteed. Mm. But what a visit from Sam. Good hundred. Okay, pressure on. Well, he went for the 12. Oh no, did he? I can't tell what he went for there, actually. Finds 48. 
54 if he does get a chance to come back. But after that turn, Sam's going to get a chance at this. 20. He's hit tops. Double 19. Oh, has he found it? Is that in? No, it's not. It's on the wire. Wait, wait, what? I missed that. I missed whatever the message was on the board there. <laughs> uh, guys, if you would like more antics from Stu, feel free to join the Discord. Uh, it's where all the action goes down. It's where you can find all of our darts players. Uh, get involved, play some friendlies. Uh, watch the the best battle it out, basically. Uh, if you'd like to join the leagues, you can jump on the reserves. Unfortunately, the league has started, but worry not. People do, unfortunately, drop out. And we have plenty of people waiting in the wings to fill in uh, those spaces. If you'd like to be one of those people, let us know. Join the Discord. That's a good dart from Stu there. Second one into the board. And that's 5-4. He's broken straight back. This game has been a roller coaster of a ride. What's been more of a roller coaster is watching Stu's messages pop up on the screen and trying to read them in small format. Uh, I'm not that quick. Good darts there. Into the double one. Doesn't matter which double you hit, as long as you hit a double, you're off the mark. Then puts the pressure onto your opponent to try and find one, and Sam doesn't do it. Doesn't find a double. This is this has been a back and forth game. Sam was leading by two legs at one point. Stu's fought right back. I think he's won the last three legs in a row, which is some going. It's good stuff there. Good scoring. So I'm now still looking for that double. I think he's found it. He has. He's managed to find the double 16. And he's off the mark as well. And a good 80 on there from Stu. Finds the treble 20. Crucially at this point. Sam is right on his tail. Oh, and he's going to fill the bed. Oh, unlucky. But again, some sensational darts there. Good Tom. Puts him right back in this one. Let's do getting ready to throw again, or is he writing another message? Okay, he's throwing. It's a good first dart. Lovely stuff. That's 84. Puts him on 74. Two dart finish coming up. Sam back on 154. That's not going to be possible now. 149 left. Oh. Oh dear. I thought we were going to see the uh, the unimaginable then. A ball finish. He's hit the 25. It's very close. Sam now with 109 remaining. He's come down for the 19s. He stayed down there. Oh, that's a good last start. I think that's found its mark. It certainly has. That's 98. If there were ever going to be pressure on this throw, he's just found it. Uh, Stu's hit treble 12. That's a bust. Sam now with a chance to break right back. And take us to 5-5. Five, five. Which way is he going to go? Three. He's, he went for the three. He's hit 17. Stu with another chance here. He's gifted it right back to him. <laughs> As Sam again shows his distaste with the two fingers at the board. Stu now three for double 11. Oof. Unfortunate. It's not quite in there. He is on a one dart finish. So I'm still requiring 11. He's hit 17 again. He does like that 17. Are we going to see the fingers again though? That's the question. We're not. 
We didn't see the fingers this time. Is that in? That is in. That's the game. 6-4 to Stu. As Sam loses that one narrowly in a battle that went back and forth. Fantastic throwing from both players. Uh, some good doubles in there and some nice scoring. Uh, very well played, Stu. Congratulations on the win. Commiserations, Sam. Uh, again, well played. It just wasn't to be today. Maybe next time. Uh, right. That was beautiful. What a stream. Do we have anything else? That's the question. Let's have a cheeky look. Is there anybody else in the wings ready to play tonight? Aha! Michael Sales and Mike McLeod were up. So I believe this is the last game of the evening. Uh, we have the two Michaels, or two Mikes. Uh, this will be a cracker. I'm excited for this one. This is a Division 3 head-to-head. -head. I'm expecting some lovely darts here. Maybe some 180s and some high finishes. No pressure, guys. Uh, Mike is in. Just waiting for the other mic. waiting for the place to get set up now thank you for tuning in tonight really appreciate guys the support has been wonderful again it's a best of seven um they're just getting themselves sorted now i'm uh, just waiting for michael to hop in uh in the live stream Maybe you'll see uh, the camera's underway uh, that's a good angle i quite like that angle big fan big fan you'll see what i mean in a minute Okay, both players are in. All right. Let me switch back over and just make sure this is all looking spicy. Wow, okay. Well, that needs to be zoomed out a touch. Uh, hmm. Let's get at least some more of the board in. Bear with, bear with while I adjust this live. <laughs> I've not had this issue before. <laughs> mm, that's what she said. Okay. Oh, that's not... Mm. That's not ideal. It's a very squished camera. See, this is why we needed it landscape, uh, portrait, not landscape. I mean, that's not too bad, actually. 
We'll get away with that for today, right? What are we saying, chat? Does that look pretty good? I myself bottom of the league, uh, but already played second game, which I won. Uh, should be mid-table. Hell yeah, very nice, dude. Love to hear it. All right. We're almost underway on this one. Just waiting for the two mics to to be ready. It's Mike and Michael. Michael and Michael. Nope, uh, they're not live yet, but I imagine they will be shortly. Oh, we've lost one. Oh, we've regained one. Lovely. Okay, again, bit of a squashed board on the right-hand side. You'll have to excuse that. Um, we'll uh, make that a little bit better in, in future. But uh, for the time being, that is all I've got for you. It's the end of the night. It's the end of the streak. Um, hard work. I mean, you got through it. I'll be honest with you. You did. And that's what's important. Work called about 5,027. Is that what is that what you were putting on your cards? I'm looking at these uh, auto queue cards, and I'll be honest with you, I couldn't see a bloody thing. I couldn't see anything that you wrote on them. <laughs> Just kept seeing these cards pop up on screen, <laughs> trying to read them. But you got through it. You got through the match, even with distractions. That's that's what counts. Don't let me get rid of that, because otherwise you're going to be able to see boxes, and that's not what we want. Ah, good evening, folks. Again, just waiting for the two Michaels to be ready. Uh, we don't have them there at the moment. I'll just be sorting their stuff out. Tell you what, whilst they're waiting to go, I'm going to nip to the toilet real quick. Thank you again for tuning in if you are enjoying it feel free to hit the like button share the stream uh let us know how you feel thank you again to the new followers and the gifters as well uh, you are much appreciated uh it's very very generous of you uh and we're loving the support it was a pleasure thanks for no it was a pleasure uh for me to be able to stream that you threw some fantastic darts in there mate it's not easy to go toe to toe with darren uh, on the best of days but you produce some fantastic darts Gladly have you on again, mate. I'll be back in two seconds. My back teeth are floating, basically. Sorry about that. We are back. Let me check if the players are ready to go. Oh, they are. Mike and Mike, we're on. Good timing as they just kick off the first leg. Wait. Camera freeze? Oh, no, we're good. We're good. I'm just going to mute um, Michael. In case there's any, any noises coming through that we don't want. Okay. Lovely. And we're in action. Good start from both players. 
95 to get off the mark from Mike and a ton from other Mike. Uh, it's going to be very difficult to keep up with this. So, um, so the top score is Mike on the left, uh, and the bottom score is Mike on the right. I think we're going to go with Mike and Michael. Yeah, I think that works. Yeah, as I said, we're in for a cracker here. These guys are heavy hitters. Good throwers of the darts. As they prove to themselves, uh, to us now, just how good they actually are. Forty-five from Mike there. Uh, Michael up now. Two nine six. I'm not too sure if these guys are. I'm not sure what's going on the score in front here. Can't really keep up with this one. Uh, as Michael hits a sixty, Mike back to the board. I think we're back in sync now. I think there was a little bit of a, a desync issue. Uh, as Mike finds all the threes. I mean, he's cracking grouping. Unfortunately, it's only a 21. A big opportunity now to close that gap. And he does so splendidly there. Good darts from Mike. Good ton. Puts him right back into this one. Michael now with 150 to check out. Would we not love to see this chat? Some cracking darts there. That is beautiful. Great 95. And with Mike not being able to check this one out, Michael has a great opportunity for this 55. Imagine we'll be seeing the 15s route. We will. 15 for tops. Gets two darts at the double top. First one a little high. And the second one will find its mark. And it looks like it can. Oh, it's not. It's just below the wire. The black tip there just deceiving me ever so slightly. Mike now with a chance to, to bounce back into this. Is that going to be enough to put the pressure onto Michael here? 20 required, double 10. That's just on the outside. That's a great marker. Third dart shouldn't find its home. And it certainly does. That's a great third dart. Just working his way in there. And the first blood goes to Michael. And a break of throw. We've had a lot of games this evening with a first leg break of throw. That's crazy. Both players looking to settle into this one now and really produce some good darts. Oh, interesting. Uh, Michael is down on the 19s. He... I didn't know he preferred the 19s. You don't see it very often, but some players do just prefer to be on 19s. And when you can hit the trebles, why not? It's a great opening 79. Oh, but what a response there from Mike. Solid ton to open the scoring. He's looking to break right back here. Oh, Michael with words to say about that one. Solid scoring again. 83. Oh, and that's straight in the centre of the treble. Can he find another one? No, but another ton. You can't argue with those numbers.
great stuff. We're seeing some really nice consistency around this 19. Likewise into that trouble 20 from Mike. Solid 76. The uh, averages are starting to climb back towards the 70s now. Do you like to see it? And this is what consistency looks like. The grouping's really solid here. It may not always be in the trebles, but it's it's always tightly grouped, and that's that's half the battle. Sixty there from Mike. Doesn't leave himself an out. And Michael now with an opportunity to get himself onto a finish. That dart will definitely help. That's a good 95. He'll be looking at a three dart finish when he comes back. 130. Oh, that's Mike now. Damage limitation. And that's only a 41. It's not going to be enough. For, you, you have to feel that he needed a treble. 130 now for Michael. Stays on the 19s. Well, took his time on that one. Maybe figuring out which way he wants to go. So it's 60 with 70 remaining. Went up for the 18s. Single 18. 52 when he returns. Assuming Mike doesn't take out this 1, 2, 4. Trouble 20. Needed. Well, he's found it on the second dart, so he's got 44 left. Does he choose 16s or tops here? I think he wants 4 or 12. It looks like he maybe went for 12, but unfortunately he's missed the board. Mike now for 52. 20 for double 16. Two darts at it. Oh, he's hit the double eight. Follow that. Give me another double eight. Oh, I think that's just in the single. He may be coming back for double four. Yeah, that's just in the eight. Double four. If he gets a chance to return, Mike now with 44 left. You can see he was trying for the 12s. He's found it this time. Double 16. He's hit the eight. Okay, back up for 12s. I think that's double five. Either that or it's just on the wire. It was double five. So close. But Michael now with a chance to snatch this one. And go two a nil up. He can't do it. Maybe a little bit of nerves in the start of this game. As he does miss the double. Mike now for double seven. Goes straight at it. No fear. Straight in. Three for double two. Oh. Tentative game. Double four still required here from Michael. That's a good marker. Oh, he's just glanced off the side of the barrel. He's coming off them. Oof, he's hit four. They're both on double two. It's 27 darts thrown now for Michael. And Mike couldn't make the most of it. Has missed the double as well. Let's go now, boys. Double two. Come on. And he's found it. Second dart. Hits its mark. And that's the second leg to Michael.
taking a two leg leader here early on and it's Mike now to get us off the mark in this the third leg solid 60 good darts that's a beautiful dart into the 19 fill the bed oh he's hit the double <laughs> well then that's something you don't see every day. That is something you don't see every day. A great 152 though. It's not quite a 180, but it feels pretty good. 152 to get us off the mark. A right, great last there. Beautiful dart. Solid ton. Guys, if you want to get involved in some of this action, maybe be on the live stream one day. You need to join the ODL. Discord. You can find links on the old ODL's Facebook. So that's Online Darts League on Facebook. Get on there. There's over 2,000 members on the Facebook uh, platform now. Absolutely astronomical numbers uh, for a community that's just getting itself off the mark. Uh, you can join TikTok as well. Over 200 people on TikTok. If you are currently watching on the TikTok live stream, welcome. Good to have you here. Uh, like, subscribe, follow, uh, share. Do all of that good stuff. Get involved. Um... We do appreciate it. Uh, if you're looking for some practice tournaments, they do run weekly on the Discord, but you do need to be on the Discord to get involved. Uh, you can find links to that on the Facebook and on the website, odldarts.com. Uh, the link for the Discord's on there. Uh, there will be links in the chat uh, at some point in the next couple of streams, um, so feel free to uh, use those as well to access the socials. Uh, if you're looking for something a little bit more relaxed, though, there are midweek tournaments. You have Monday Madness. That's a 301 double in tournament. We've seen some doubling action this evening between Stu and Sam, of which our fearless leader came off the winner. Uh, Tuesday Turmoil is a 701 best of three bracket tournament. You have Big Fish Wednesdays. That's 170. Biggest finishing darts. Can you land the big boy? Uh, if you're looking to get involved in that, it's a 701 best of five. Uh, Thursday Throwdown is a 401 double in bracket tournament. And Sunday Fun Day is a quick fire 101 best of nine. Get yourselves involved. Come along, join the Discord, and have some fun. There's also friendlies going on all the time. There's always someone to play. Uh, we have a great community here of amazing people who are always willing to help, offer advice, or just play a game of darts, whatever you fancy. Um, season 2 sponsored by Mission Darts uh, the wonderful people at Mission Darts here uh, dropping us a sponsorship for Season 2 is well underway uh, the first week has been completed how did you guys fare in your first weeks how did you get on the tables I am currently top of my table uh, <clears throat> as of as of last week anyway uh, that's probably not going to last but you know I'm enjoying it while I, while I can um, let us know in the chat that's not how you got on Hopefully you did well. Uh, if you didn't, there's always next week. There's always an opportunity to bounce back. Uh, more importantly, you can find uh, Mission Darts on their socials, on Instagram, at Mission Darts, uh, on X, formerly known as Twitter, that's at Mission Darts as well, and Mission Darts on YouTube, where they've got some great content, some fantastic videos. You can also follow us on our uh, YouTube, uh, where you'll find all of our live streams as well. Previous live streams, some fantastic games in the past. Uh, that we've covered uh, some superstars within the uh, division as we see Mike there I believe check out oh no he hasn't he's just on the wire of double nine uh, where we've seen some absolute crackers of games there was even a game that we covered uh, not too long ago where uh, one of the opponents hit seven 180s in a best of six match or best of seven match wild stuff absolutely crazy if you want to get involved, again, the Discord is where you want to be. So, why not join us? Thank you very much. As we rejoin the action. And uh, Michael only managing to tag a 31 there. So Mike's going to get three darts to this double nine. He's not going to need all three by the looks of things. Is that first dart in? That is in. And he managed to pull the leg back. It's not against the throw, it's with the throw, but still. You've got to get that leg on the board, and he's managed to get off the mark. Lost week one, won today. Hell yeah, sounds very good, Stu. 
returned the uh, sorry turned over that deficit of uh, of a loss. For round, they need to put one of my games on here. My first season two game was a cracker six six. I mean, all you gotta do, dude, is let us know. Let us know that you want to play. We'll work around the uh, the stream schedule, uh, and if you're able to book a, a, a game in whilst whilst we're streaming, we'll we'll have a look at getting you on board and getting you in. We missed a, a few cracking games. Uh, my brother was in a six. six Wait, Paul, was it you that my brother played, Jordan? He was in a six six game. His scoring wasn't up to par, but he's finishing. My word, unbelievable! Oh no, it was Simeon he played. Yeah, he had like uh, three three checkouts, like high eighties, nineties, unbelievable. Four checkouts, high nineties and eighties, crazy stuff. Um, my games, I've got games on Friday, so I'll be playing the semi-final of the preseason cup against Toby McLeod on uh, on Friday, where I'll probably get absolutely spanked. Um, he's a very good player. <laughs> I'm not sure I'm up to that level yet. But uh, I'll try and give him my best. Uh, and then I've got my league game against Sean Martin, who is also throwing very well and was top of the league up until my game. Um, so I imagine he's in for a uh, in for a close one, hopefully, if I can produce some good darts. We all like to put on a show. As to these gents here, so it's 2-1 in legs. Mike, I believe, with the throw. Oh, sorry, Michael with the throw in this one. Uh, looking to make it 3-1. Mike will need to break back. Uh, he is currently scoring the better of the, the two players. Uh, averaging 63 with a 75 uh, first nine average. Uh, the doubles are identical at 14.29%. Uh, Mike's hit 1 out of 7, uh, while uh, Michael's hit 2 out of 14. So, some really good stuff. Yeah, it's hard to it's hard to say really. I mean, you can you can put a game on and, and it could be an absolute thriller, or you could put a game on and it could be a a dud. You know, it could just be like a seven nil uh, whitewash. Both games are enjoyable. It's just landing lucky and getting those six sixes and you know the ones with the high scoring, high finishing. Because we're all capable of it. And it's just putting it all together on the same day. That's what makes us amateurs. Okay, Mike now needing 100. He went 20 tops, tops. I don't know if he's hit it. He didn't. It was just on the wire, but valiant effort there. Wants double top when he comes back, and he will be coming back. There's a 201, uh, 209 deficit there. So all Michael can do really is try and try and just peg this number down, and get himself on a finish, just in case Mike does miss this, but. With three darts in hand, you got to feel he's going to hit this. He's hit 20, he wants double 10. Just on the wire, good marker there, use that. It's just over the top of it. That's unfortunate. That is unfortunate. Okay, 152 now from Michael. Treble 20. Needs another one of them. Has he found a nut? No, he's not found a Unlucky. Sets it well though. 84. Okay. Three darts in hand. We need to see a double. You can't get any closer without being in there. That is right on the wire. Agony. If Michael can steal this one with this 68... That's gonna that's gonna sting. That's gonna leave a bad taste in the mouth. Well they go for the twenties, you would imagine so. He's hit twenty. Question is, does he go sixteen for double sixteen or eight for tops? That's a bit of a blocker. I'd go sixteen for sixteens here. He does that and that's a good marker for it. Bouncing off the barrel. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. He sets it up well. But it does give Mike another opportunity here for this double ten. 
He's had nine darts at a finish so far. Not been able to find it. That's got to be in, though. That looks like a good dart to me. He certainly is. He's found it. Uh, just realising now that these doubles are not accurate. Uh, the players are not inputting the, uh, the correct amount of doubles. So the double figures are completely wrong. Um, never mind. Don't look at the doubles. Don't look at the checkout rate. It's false advertisement. Oh boy. Well, it's 2 2 now. And he's broke right back. Oh, beautiful. Into the 19s again. He loves those 19s, I tell you. So good scoring. 1 2 1. not the best visit 57 I mean 57 is a good visit but you feel like in this game with the way they've been scoring 57 is going to feel like a bad visit when you don't get a treble but they just don't seem to miss that big number do they just whittling away the scores here constant 60s constant 57s and trebles found now that is a loose one that is a loose one an opportunity here now for Mike to break right back into this. Need some solid darts. Only 22. Maybe the pressure getting to him a bit. It's best of seven legs, so it is first to four this. There won't be a draw here. There has to be a winner. So someone's going to take this one. Uh, I feel like both these players will be kicking themselves. They are capable of producing much higher numbers than this. Uh, they're kind of neck and neck at the moment. They're cancelling each other out. Uh, no one player has really got themselves into this game. And I'm really... Grabbed it by the by the horns. Still an opportunity for this though. Still an opportunity. See some good scoring again there from Mike. Michael now on one oh two. He's hit the single fives. Ninety seven, so it's not over yet. Trouble nineteen. She does favour. He's hit the seven. Maybe 18s. He's hit the travel 19. So he's going to be coming back for 33. Maybe not the best decision there. Not leaving himself a one dart checkout. I mean, Mike is back on 218. So maybe he's thinking he's got room to breathe. He has the ability to kind of maybe take the slow route. But I get the feeling Mike's got other ideas. That's a ton. That puts the pressure on. So 33 needed now. It's going to be 17 double eight. Uh, he's gone one for... Oh, he's hit double 15. He's found treble one and hit double 15. Who am I to question? Who am I to question when you can find the doubles like that? Great darts, three two. 
good stuff. He's managed to to break throw again. We've had a lot of breaks of throw in in these games tonight, and this one hasn't steered from the course. These are back and forth games, and now Mike with the darts to take this one. Again, this is a best of seven. He's three two up. That's a good second dart, a uh, third dart. Finds the treble. 81 scored. Lovely stuff. Consistent into the 19s. That's great. If he keeps finding a trouble of visit here like this, he's in good position to break straight back. And we could have a game that goes all the way here. Well, that's a great visit there. 95. That's good stuff from Michael. He needed that one. Again, it is his throw, but he's in danger of losing it. Some heavy scoring here from Mike. That's a great first start. He's followed it. Can he follow it with a third? Oh, he has, but is that in? Is that a 180? It's a 140. Agony on the wire. I thought we'd seen our first 180 of the match. Oh, we might be seeing our first 171. Oh, no! <laughs> Oh, it was almost there. Cracking darts. 1-3-3. Three, three. Beautiful stuff. I'll tell you what. This game's delivering. It really is. Oh, and he's back in the trebles again. He's back in them again. Oh, lovely stuff. Oh, wait. No, he's not. Apparently, that wasn't in the treble. That was treble three. At uh, treble one. Oh, I thought that was in the 20s. It's hard to see. Oh, it's 57. I think it's 102. Mike back on 142. Has a chance to check this out. What trouble 20, trouble 14, double top. So there's not going to be a check out this time around. But he can give himself a good chance at getting down to a two dart finish. And that's not the way to do it. 101. Mike now with 102 required. Three data. Trouble 20. We stayed on the 19s. Okay. So he's going three data anyway, so he might as well. So 57 there. Let me do the maths quickly. He's got 45 left. So he wants 13 for double 16. He's got one dart at this. And one dart is just not enough. It's agony. It's close. But no cigar. He might get a chance to come back for this 32 if Mike doesn't check out the 101. He's hit a single 20. So he wants treble 19 for double 12. He's hit the 19. That's okay. He can set it up and put a bit of pressure on. Back up to the 20s. Oh, and he's thinking which way he wants to go. Okay, he's... He's gone maybe with the treble tw tens. I can't really can't work out what he's decided on there. But maybe, yeah. Oh, Mike, now three darts in hand for the match. Double 16 required. That's 16. Once double eight. Come on, a little bit higher. Beautiful dart. He's found it with a second. And that is all she wrote folks good game between the two guys thank you very much for playing folks appreciate that what a way to end it a 4-2 victory there for mike mcleod uh, and mike sales unfortunately just missing out very well played and great sportsmanship there from mike uh guys thank you very much for watching what a stream what a day that is a big dartboard <laughs> 
That is not what I intended for us to see. But why not? We'll end on that. Um, could turn this off and you can have a look. Oh, no, hang on. Well, I buggered that up, Anna. Hey? My word. Stop messing with things, Chris. Guys, thank you very much for watching. Again, if you want to get in on the action, potentially be on the stream one day, uh, you need to join the Discord. You can find the Discord online on uh, the website. It's odldarts.com. Uh, hop on there. There's a lot of other good stuff on there as well. Merchandise and the like. Uh, you can also join the Facebook and the TikTok. I've been Chris. You've been a pleasure. It's time for me to sign off for the evening. Until the next time when we join you with more fantastic content from the guys at the ODL. Have a good evening.